Hey Planner friends, it's your girl Tiff from Tiff Planet and welcome back to my channel. So I am super excited for this week because I am collabing with one of my um, planner friends, uh, April, who is Georgia Girl Plans on Instagram as well as on YouTube. And we are collabing using this beautiful, beautiful seaside kit from Dash of Sun Designs. So, um, I am super excited. I absolutely love Georgia Girl Plants. Absolutely. Well, we both had this kit from Dash of Sun Designs. I absolutely love uh, Chelsea, uh, way that Chelsea's kits and the way that she designs her kits. They're so well made. Uh, the foiling is always so pretty. I love the fact that she does this like layered bottom washi. Um, I, I love the font at the top of uh, that she uses for her uh, day covers. I just absolutely really, really love how she really formats her kits. They're very easy to plan with. Um, she is currently um, on a maternity leave because she just had a cute little bundle of joy. Uh, he is absolutely adorable. Um, and so I totally understand. Uh, so I believe she's taking, taking, she's taking a maternity leave and taking off for a year um, to kind of have some mommy bonding time with her brand new baby and getting used to uh, mommy life. So, anywho, um, make sure you guys keep her on your radar for uh, for next year when she comes back. Um, but if you guys care to see how I planned with this layout as well as April from Georgia Girl Plans, then please keep watching. I will also have April's YouTube link to her video in the description box below. And then let me give you guys a, a little bit of a viv wiggle really quick because this kit is so pretty. Can you guys see the Lego? Is it working? Oh, isn't that pretty? Okay. <laughs> Anywho, guys, hope that you guys are having an amazing day. And then let's get started with this plan with me. So this is the seaside kit that me and April will be using for this week. I absolutely love it. It's absolutely gorgeous. Um, just briefly going through everything that you guys will that that comes in the kit. Um, and then uh, I do love the fact that she has the extra full box here um, and that she layers the bottom while she's absolutely gorgeous. So again, this is the kit that me and April from Georgia Girl Plans will be using for this week. Make sure that you guys go over to her page and check out her layout as well. And let's hop into this plan with me. And this, or this is the uh, foil add-on that you guys get. And this is the 5th of August through the 11th of August. Okay, going ahead and laying down the bottom washi. And again, you guys see a little bit of a peekaboo of my head. That is the norm for me <laughs> when it comes to doing uh, my bottom washi. Go figure. Anyways, I realized that my bottom washi was upside down. And so I ended up turning it around and um, putting it back down. And so I'm just going to lay down my bottom washi per the usual and i am i'm just so in love with how the little seashells in this um the uh the, the big portion of the bottom washi and then the little thin like five millimeter strip of bottom washi how she did that is just so absolutely gorgeous um i'm just i i, I i've never been disappointed with a dash of sun designs kit as in ever um i believe my first dash of sun designs kit was actually a coffee kit that i will be using for this fall but my first one that i actually planned in or planned with was my easter layout and it was just it was everything and i've been thoroughly impressed and thoroughly pleased um, going forward and everything that i've used from her so going ahead and laying down these absolutely gorgeous date covers i did use some of the non-foiled date dots that i had from my leftover from chic blossom prints i thought that that looked a little bit better to me sometimes the foil um the foil date dots along with the foiled um date covers sometimes um are a little bit too much for me so i like the contrast a little bit of having the regular um black um date dots sometimes so that is what i did um, and these are actually kiss cut date dots from Chic Blossom Prints that I used from a leftover um, of hers. I always get the deluxe add on, and so I always have extra um, date date dots to use from her layouts. 
and then on to putting down continuing to put down my um date dots and then i also put down of course my 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 page flags along with um my little accents i don't know if you guys have noticed here lately i've been putting down like the um tassel planner bows on my page flags and i think that that is so pretty i absolutely love it um i changed it up a little bit this week because um dash of dash of some designs has the foil add-on that you're able to get and it comes with these absolutely adorable um hearts and so i thought that, that was really pretty so I, instead of me using my tassel planner bows this week i ended up using the hearts um from the kit from the foil add-on to put in the middle of my page flags and I'm always, as usual, on the struggle bus when it comes to putting down my page flags. I don't know what it is about putting down these page flags. I have to do it 15,000 times before it actually um, gets centered. Go figure. Anywho, I'm going to go ahead and lay down this um, full box that says wild and free, just like the sea. Um, and then finish laying down all of my full boxes as, as well as laying down um, the glitter headers and I'll be right back. okay i am back i am back i am back <laughs> okay ignore my ignore my randomness okay you guys i'm, I'm being silly today um went ahead and put down <laughs> i went ahead and put down some of the um foil um simply gilded wash you with the white bows i think it's so pretty and then i went ahead and put down the monday through sunday tracker i'm going to be using this to um indicate what i did for um this week um, as far as like my posts and my posts kind of got away from me a little bit this week. I, um, <clears throat> I ended up getting really busy at work. And so, I um, I think my last post was my, uh, midweek post and then, um, kind of fell off a little bit. So putting down a, another one of those, um, printed or yeah, yeah, printed <laughs> our patterned, um, wash headers from the kit and then putting down the. Uh, habit trackers and i'm going to be using um, one of the habit trackers to um track my tattoo care um my daughter said that she is my tattoo care expert <laughs> so um she has had, made a little chart and everything that she wants me to sign every time she um you know washes and puts ointment on my tattoo which i thought was super cute Anyways, I went ahead and put down these cute little foiled bows, not bows, foiled uh, polka dot um, washi that I got from Target. Put that down as a background, and then I'm going to be putting, putting down an ombre checklist, and I'm going to be using this to indicate what I'm going to be cleaning or focusing on cleaning for that week. And these this clean script is from uh, Plush Papery, and then I'm going to be using the same script for my this week script. And then I'm also starting a challenge this week, which is the Megan Good um, 30 Day Challenge. And um, I've been, as I've been, as I'm doing this voiceover, this is, it is day five. And I have not done, I've only worked out twice. I'm supposed to work out every day. I am already on the struggle bus and falling off when it comes to doing this, um, this challenge. Now, I will say this though. 
I have been doing really, really good with um, making sure that I am eating everything that I'm supposed to be eating and eating the right way and um, not eating junk food. So I have been doing that. But the struggle bus of me actually working out has been it's been a challenge, it's definitely been a challenge. Um, so <laughs> I, have to, I have to do better, though, because I really want to um, I want to, I want to lose um, not necessarily I, I, I won't say lose. I won't, I, don't, I don't have an issue with the size that I am. I really just want to tone. Um, I want to, um, tone my thighs and, um, of course my core area. Anyways, went ahead to Sunday and put down a, um, quarter box as well as this cute little church icon from Tassel Petter. And here's a cute little, quick little Viv Wiggle. It is so gorgeous. Oh my God. I love this kid. So now I'm just going ahead and laying down these, um, bow headers from Samantha Me Sticks. And I knew I had this um, like muted kind of gray with some silver bows. I uh, couldn't remember, couldn't find it. Ended up finding it, so I'm very happy. And so I'm going to go ahead and put down my uh, bow headers from Samantha May Sticks. These are definitely coming in handy. I kind of went crazy when I um when she when she first came out with these uh, her baby her her bow headers as well as her uh, bow her bow washi um, washi strips. I kind of went a little crazy and have. Pretty much every color that she came out with. <laughs> Don't judge me. Don't judge me. <laughs> um, I, I typically tend to do that. When I find like something, I typically go overboard and get every color, um, every color way. And that's just what I do. Anywho, hopping over to Monday, putting down a quarter box from the kit along with an edit script sticker from Art Box Stickers to indicate that I was going to be editing a play with me. And then putting down one of these uh, page facts from the kit along with the Lazy Day script from Chic Street Sticker Boutique. And then I'm going to be putting down one of these um, shower girl stickers, um, like she's taking a shower and kind of lounging all day from Miss Moss. And I thought that that was perfect to indicate that I was going to just have a lazy day. I was not going to do my hair. Um, I was not going, I'm going to take a shower and put some more PJs back on and chillax. So then it's putting down another one of those uh, patterned, uh, headers and then putting down the coffee monday script from kenzie's creations which i absolutely love her uh black lettering um script and then putting down one of these bow icons from sadie stickers to indicate that i had my monday coffee and then putting down another quarter box from the kit along with one of the page flags and i'm going to be using this to indicate that i did my voiceover for one of my play with me's and then taking one of these foil check check checks check marks from a uh, giving girls leftover to indicate that I did my voiceover. Um, next, I'm going to be putting down a Netflix brilliant band script, also from Kenzie's Creations, and I'm going to be using this to indicate that I was binge watching a new uh, show that I found called Skin Wars, which is kind of like face off to me, and then that little cute little uh, uh movie sloth is from um Lisa Lorraine designs or Lisa Lorraine plans I'm sorry and then putting down one of those one third boxes from Rose Color Days along with a paint nails script from Art Box Stickers and then a nail polish sticker from Gabrielle and Designs to indicate that I painted my nails and then I believe this um divider came from um Moose and Mittens in a freebie that I got and then I'm going ahead and just writing in what I was going to be tracking for the week, which was, like I said earlier, my tattoo care from my tattoo care expert, which is my my baby, my oldest. She's still my baby, but I have to remember to stop saying baby because I say baby and the people are like, yeah, I'm talking about my my youngest. I'm talking about They're both my babies. And then putting down that I was going to be doing the Making Good Every Day Challenge. Yay me. I'm going to, I'll keep you guys posted on my progress, okay? Because I, uh, I really want to do good. Um. But it's been a struggle. And then putting down what I wanted to make sure that I focused on for cleaning that week. Um, I really need to clean off my um planner desk. It is it's 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 a lot. I will say that. It is definitely um <laughs> it's a it's a work in progress. I, I need to make sure that I do better with cleaning off my um because I my desk is uh half planner related, half makeup related, and so it gets a little out of control sometimes, so I need to do better with that. Yeah. <laughs> um, anywho, you guys will just continue to see me fiddling that in. And then I'm going to hop over to um, my 
Tuesday, and I'm going to just go ahead and start talking about what I am going to be doing on Tuesday. And you guys, as the use, per usual, you guys know, ever since I've started working at Old Sub Beauty, I have my uh, weekly conference call on Tuesday um, for all of the uh, salon managers where we talk about, you know, all the, the wonderful things that are going on with our district. So putting a quarter box down from the kit. And then I'm going to be putting down, of course, my customized Nettie Designs uh, conference call script. And after I put that down, I'm going to then be putting down another quarter box from the kit um, to indicate that I needed to do some rearranging of the ske schedules for uh, my stylist. Um, so where they're more productive. I'm then putting down um, this... Uh, Lap, laptop sticker from the uh, foiled sampler then putting down another one of those uh, pattern headers from the kit along with a uh, half box from the kit and I'm going to be using this to indicate what I needed to do for uh, that day and uh, which is you know do our um, our weekly progress report as well as um, doing um, my step uh, doing the schedule that I need to do and then putting down another quarter box from the kit to indicate that I needed to go back to school shopping with my oldest daughter. And then putting down these cute little um, script or like page flags, ribbon type of uh, full box divider from Chic Street Sticker Boutique. And then next I'm going to just be filling in everything. We uh, ended up doing a, we have a new form that we have to fill out at work. And so we had to go over that uh, at work. And then I'm just filling in everything that I told you guys I was doing for that day. And that is pretty much it for my Tuesday. Um, I um, ended up switching out that um, quarter box and then putting a different one because I didn't like the way that I wrote what I was um, doing as, as well as um, I just, it just didn't look, look right to me. So then I went ahead and put down um, one of the little like book type of um, script stickers or not script stickers, icon stickers to uh, indicate that I needed to rearrange the schedule. I ended up doing it on like a piece of paper or a little notebook first to kind of make sure that it was gonna work for everyone. And then I went ahead and did it on the computer. And you guys just see me filling in everything else that I did for um, Tuesday. And then I'm gonna hop over to Wednesday. And on Wednesday, I put down a half box from the kit along with one of the telephone stickers from the kit to indicate that it was I needed to confirm the clients that we were going to be having for uh for that for that day or for that week and then I'm going to be putting down this uh pink room co um bow holographic bows I thought that would look really pretty with um this this kit you know I, I feel like holographic and silver kind of just goes really well together um, and then putting down down act as a, kind of like a little divider, and then I'm going to be putting down another one of these quarter boxes from the kit, along with a coffee first script letter, block lettering script from Kinsey's Creation, and then I can't remember where this little <laughs> like blob or a little furry 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 friend came from. But I'll make sure I put that in the description box below, and then putting down another page flag from the kit. And I'm going to be using another one of the Kinsucations block letters. And I'm going to be using the pay bills ones along with the uh, money um, icon from the uh, foil sampler to indicate that I needed to pay some bills. And then putting down another quarter box from the um, the Lockhart & Co. Um, I got some neutral uh, quarter boxes and then putting the reminder sticker down to indicate that I needed to put in a ticket at work to uh, because our washer our washing machine was, was broken as well as some of the lights in the salon were broken so I needed to make sure that I put a ticket in so that those could get fixed and then the um, be the change that be the change script sticker is from be TD shop and I absolutely love that sticker it just kind of just motivates me and keeps me encouraged throughout the week um, especially with you know this position being a new position sometimes I get a little discouraged so anywho uh, on to Thursday I am going ahead putting down a half box from the kit and along with a um, mail or happy mail or envelope icon from 
the foil sampler to indicate that I needed to go to the post office. And then putting down another quarter box from the kit along with a nail polish sticker from Gabrielle and Lena Designs to indicate that I needed to go to my nail appointment. Um, and then putting down a coffee break script icon from White Deer Stationery. And I forgot that I actually had these and I'm like... Um, so they're so, they're so hoarding in my in my kit in my collection and I'm so excited that I remembered that I had them because they're absolutely gorgeous and then putting down another one of those quarter boxes from um, the Lockhart and Co and then putting down a Candy Creations edit sticker to indicate that I'm going to be editing and playing with me and then putting down that laundry time uh, script icon from a white deer station Yeti. next putting down another one of the quarter box uh, one third boxes from rose color days along with the giving girl um leftovers uh, that little dumbbell to indicate that the making good 30 day challenge started that day and that i was going to be um getting some foods ready and um going to grocery store things like that just that it was i was doing to that that was starting that challenge that day and like i said guys i've been struggling with it already like i have not worked out like i should but i will get back on the ball um today and you know, like you guys know about my progress that I am making with that. I um, I really just kind of want to tone, and um, you know, get some things tight and right, <laughs> like they used to be. Um, back onto um Friday, I'm gonna go ahead and put down a bills do sticker along with the money icon from the kit, and then putting down these black um headers from the rose color day sampler, and I'm gonna stagger two of them, and. Not two of them, sorry, I'm sorry. That's that's for Saturday. I'm gonna stagger one of them, and then I'm gonna be putting this Kinsey Creations clean room sticker along with a Miss Moss cleaning diva girl. <laughs> I always call them a diva girl because they just look so cute. Um and then after I do that, I'm gonna be putting down another half box from the kit to indicate that I was going to be um binge watching my new favorite show called Skin Wars. I really hope that, that show comes back because it kind of reminds me of uh, the, the show face off then i'm uh, hopping over to saturday putting down another half box from the kit and i'm going to be using this to indicate that um you know as a salon manager uh, i have to help everybody else get meet their goals and um and two of the uh other stylists that i have um met their goal of goal of getting to comma club so it was three of us out of a salon of five stylists that met comma club over the week and so i wanted to make sure that i marked that down because that was totally awesome then i'm going to be putting down one of these cute little foil dumbbells that i actually got from the stickers in the back of my air conjure <laughs> i rarely use those stickers but this one came in handy and then I'm, and then i'm using a workout script sticker from a leftovers from a the, from a giving girl kit that i had and then i'm using these, these cute little uh, corner scallop um to add some deco to um, this half box to indicate that we were making comic club. Then I want to put this um, nice little quote that says, believe in yourself from Saucy Stickers Co. And uh, I am a PR girl for her. So make sure you check the description box below for a discount code to save on some uh, products from uh, Rebecca. And then putting down another uh, one third box from the Rose Color Days sampler. And I'm going to use that to indicate that I need to approve my time card so that I can get paid next week. And then I'm putting one of the laptop stickers from the uh, sampler, uh, the foil sampler that came with the kit. And then you guys were just be putting in that I needed to approve my time card, the time card, because your girl wants to get paid. <laughs> and then putting down... And then putting down one of those white deer stationery um, icons that I got that I think are so absolutely adorable. And then putting down a TV icon from the Jackson Pepper leftovers that I had along with these little balloons to celebrate our, our, our accomplishment as a salon. And then putting down another uh, quarter box from the kit to indicate that I needed to do uh, my voiceover for my birthday plan with me. Um, next putting down another one of those so next putting down some more of those header black headers from rose color days and i'm going to be using the be the change script from b e t t d b e p d shop again um because it just uh, i was really encouraged by the fact that um you know my team you know are you know are really striving to hit their goals and you know it makes me feel good to to notice to know that i you know have made some changes and um it's helping uh, everyone you know excel 
I'm going ahead and putting down another half box from the kit and I'm going to be using this and I'm going to just put a um, treat yourself um, script that I actually got again from the one of the stickers in the back of my Erin Condren. Erin Condren is uh, saving the day for this uh, plan with me you guys. Um, next putting down another one of those Lockhart & Co quarter boxes and then putting down an, um, one of the uh, hair hair stickers, the uh, comb and shears, which I'm actually going to be using. And I, I'm using that to indicate that I was going to be taking down my faux locks. And then putting down another one of the half boxes from the kit. And I'm going to be putting down a low battery emoji from the Coffee Monster Co. To indicate that it was an extremely busy day at work. And I was just, I was, I was out of energy. I didn't have any more to give to anybody I was just I was done I was completely done that day um and so next I'm just filling in everything that I did on Saturday that I had a busy day and I didn't have I didn't have no more to give <laughs> and also that um we all made comic club for those of us that wanted to make comic club which is a huge accomplishment I was super super excited um as a salon manager that just made my day and then on to sunday putting in that i am um, we're going to be going to church that day and then i was going to be taking my locks down and then after that i um went ahead and put down one of the o o order online stickers or half boxes from rose color days to indicate that i was going to be ordering my braid hair because i'm going to be getting my hair braided again um, and I needed to order my hair and so I just went ahead and put that down and that is it guys for this plan with me hope that you guys enjoyed make sure that you guys are, are following me and on Instagram and uh, again make sure that you guys go over and head over to April's page and make sure that you guys watch her plan with me as well to see how she did her spin on this week's layout as well till next time guys happy planning